everyone and welcome to Food Review UK. My name is MJ and today we are reviewing another Degusta box. This is, I think, the Easter one. Yeah, I think they're calling it the Easter Degusta box. It's March. It's the end of March. I'm filming this on the 22nd of March. You should tell me it's an Easter one. I think it's an Easter one. Yeah, they're calling it an Easter one. I don't know if it'll have Easter eggs in or anything, but uh, it's actually Claire and I's 12 year anniversary. We've been together for 12 years. We could have reared a ch if we, you know, had sex before we entered a relationship, conceived a child. Uh, we could have reared a child that could now go and witness. Reared, raised. Raised a child. They could now go and witness Spider-Man One, the original. Spider-Man. It was just called one called Spider-Man One, or other 12 films. 12 They're certificate. They're not called 12 anymore. They're called people. Yeah, they're called, they're called PG, yeah, dick. They're called 12A, Claire. Oh, yeah, 12A. Speaking of A, did you find out about A in Pretty Little Lies? Yeah, apparently it's a, a frog. No, that is a joke. Uh, right, with this, uh, I think the code is still valid. ZO2DE, I think that's what it is. Uh, if it's slightly wrong, then it's on screen anyway. Uh, I should also mention there's two versions of this. Oh, uh... Uh, anyway, there's two versions. <laughs> I'll, I'll explain that in a minute. There's two versions of this. One with alcohol in and one not. I think we've got both. Okay, there's some good stuff in here as well. Okay, so Piper's, we've got a big bag of Piper's crisp, cider vinegar and sea salt. Shame because not my flavour, so Claire will eat them, but Piper's is a really, really good brand. So that is good. The thing I was sighing at is their product of the month. Now, actually, I think it's fantastic that they've included these. Um, the new Oreo mint and peanut butter uh, Oreo dairy milk bars. Uh, yeah, I think it's great they're they're in here, but um, that's yeah no that one's quite good to be fair. But this one is I don't know I don't know I gave it a three I think it's average but it doesn't use real peanut which annoys me. We've got pure hot cider here with a subtle twist. Well isn't isn't that interesting? This is an alcoholic uh, cider drink. The packaging is excellent. Um, that's really cool. That's good. And then we've got uh, Capel Road Cider. So we've got two kind of craft ciders here. That's very interesting. I'll do a real, probably a double review of both of them. Um, I've never had like craft cider before. Before. And I'm not racist. Before you say. Does that cider give you a dodgy arm though? No, it's only uh, Copperberg pear cider. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I had hashtag anecdote. I had there was a, a I went on a bender once, uh, not bender, just went to the pub really, um, and had lots of Copperberg pear ciders, and my arm uh, it ached for four or five days, like intensely ached. It was unbearable, very 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 painful. So um, yeah, uh, we got Natura Naturelli jelly juice. Jelly juice, apple and blackcurrant, that's weird. I might try that in a minute. Weird, weird, weird. Uh, right, I'm going to try and pick up the things that I know what they are. Uh, we've got blueberry and blackberry Weetabix on the go. I have tried that on the channel. Um, it's where I said, I'm not a nutritionalist. I'm not a nutritionalist. So that is from that video. You can check that out. Give it a little search. Uh, what have we got here? Oh, this is good. I've always wanted to try this one. This is uh, Rebel Chocolate Coconut Milk Drink with Cacao. It's got a Great Taste Gold Award. Looks a bit pretentious for my liking, but that's just my opinion. Uh, we've got this Weetabix on the go vanilla. Again, pretty sure we got a review of that on the channel. And that is absolutely delicious. I love that stuff. So I'll probably uh, probably have that at work this week. Probably tomorrow, because uh, my, my lunches have not been good this week. They've just been, I don't mean they've been like unhealthy, they've just been crap. I haven't enjoyed them. Uh, just, it's my own fault, I didn't buy anything. Uh, we've got Heinz, uh, oh this is brand new I think, Heinz Seriously Good Creamy Tomato and Garlic Sauce, perfect for chicken. Um, I think that's brand new, I think they've just released uh, a range of about five of these new Seriously Good sauces. I think uh, Garlic Mayo might be in one of them, what is it, Tomato and Garlic? Weird, interesting, that's probably like a Tomato and Garlic Mayo itself. Um, we've got in here... No, it's like a condiment. Oh. It's 
It's a condiment, isn't it? Creamy it's not like sauce. A sauce. Oh, I don't know. No, I'm pretty sure it's yeah, it's a condiment. How weird. Upgrade your chicken and grilled meat dishes by adding a spoonful of our rich and oh yeah, it just said yeah, it says upgrade your chicken and grilled <coughs> meat dishes by adding a spoonful. But uh, I don't know, that sounds weird. No, that no, it is. No, it is. It is. It is a condiment. Uh, we got Whitworth's full of super raw cacao uh, bar. This one's crowned with almonds, seeds, chia, quinoa, and acai. Uh, all the kind of pretentious superfoods. I said pretentious a few times, but it, yeah, that's what I think they are. Um, yeah, that'll be right again. This is all lunch food for me. Uh, we've got two bars of that. That's good. Yeah, they're exactly the same. Uh, we've got a few things left. Oh, fuck off. That is incredible. This Mal stuff. Malden smoked sea salt. This stuff is expensive, I think. Um, I've always wanted smoked sea salt. That is, oh my god, this is this is fantastic news. I, I was leaving this till last because I thought it was tea or something. I thought it was a box of tea. I saw that at its side. I was like, ugh, boring tea. But, um, oh my god. Yes, please. Can't smell it. But yeah, look at that. Smoked sea salt. That is absolutely fantastic. Oh, I'm chuffed with that. And Malden, obviously the best brand. We got one pounders chocolate eclairs. Nice. And the last product in here, I think this is probably our uh, non alcoholic drink, I would assume. We've got lemon energy bursting with botanicals. <sighs> you have to keep that in. Oh, you're so annoying! Trying to film a fucking professional video here. Got gusto organic lemon energy bursting with botanicals. Weird. I'd try that now, but uh, obviously it should be refrigerated. Oh. <laughs> Trying to film a professional video so that your outburst is I'm not like this before you die. For God's sake, Claire. Uh, right, so our um, cards, we got two. Oh, oh yeah, uh, yeah, look, Easter box. There wasn't any Easter eggs in there. I would want I would want a cream egg or something in there. I thought there was going to be a nice little pack of mini, like, not not Cadbury's mini eggs, but you know what I mean, like mini yeah. chocolate eggs. Yeah, 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 In the non-alcoholic version, uh, you get the, yeah, the, the Gusto Organic Lemon Energy Drink. Um, I'm just checking that I've got all the things. Uh, it says here that you get a Jelly Bean Factory. Uh, gums in one of them as well, uh, uh, beans in one of them as well, but obviously we didn't get them. Um, and it looks like the Heinz sauces, you get one of, uh, one of two flavours. I can't see what the other one is. Black pepper mayo? Yeah, black pepper mayo. And there's a, a nice recipe sheet on the, on the other side. And then in the alcoholic one, yeah, you simply get the two ciders instead. So, um, yeah, it's just swapped, swapped out, swapped in, so this one's actually higher value. for the lemon so go alcoholic is what I'd say um, that's uh, again another really good degusta box so plenty of stuff in there um, you know top brands Cadbury although I was you know a bit like Ooh, to see them but just because I didn't like them um, Piper's is amazing Heinz obviously great brand really love the Weetabix uh, drink interesting stuff another good degusta box uh, oh yeah I did say I was going to try this didn't I weird look at that it's like a flower cap Oh, you know this is going to be weird. I'm not sure about this. This is for children, really. Jelly drink. It's puree. It? No, it's jelly drink. <clears throat> Smells like apple and black currant, even though it's... Oh, oh it's apple and black currant, actually. I think I said might have said blackberry earlier. Mmm. Mmm. Probably children would like this. I'm not sure I can get on with that texture, to be honest. Try some of that, Claire. It's very gelatinous, but also very runny. Doesn't quite work for me. Claire's reaction was, yeah, about as positive as mine. Not sure on that That's one. That's pretty sharp. No, I don't think it's that sharp. It is Just pretty sharp. Foil, normal foil. You're not going to cut yourself on that. Uh, I'd give that probably two. Yeah, uh, flavours are right. Just one of those cheap apple and blackcurrant, really. Uh, but yeah, all, all, all good, all good. Thank you very much for watching another Degusta Box review and unboxing. We hope that you check them out, guys. This is the number one 
place to be in the world. Uh, thanks for watching. Goodbye.